How's it going, my mates? I just want to let you guys know that I'm officially 18. Um, Christ, it's crazy looking back to me when I was 18. That was 10 years ago now. Shit. I'm 28 now. Welcome to old age. Oh my god. Back then I was trying to be quiet because I didn't want to let everyone know I was recording videos because it really wasn't as accepted back then as it is now. I'm quiet now for a different reason. I just got home and it's 3.30 a.m. from a long trip, which is a different story, but just got home and I've been putting off doing this video, but here it is. I'm 28. I think 18 year old me would be happy with where I'm doing right now. Honestly, I'm still streaming, I'm still making content, something I loved then, something I love now to this day. I don't really know if there's anything really I could say to him besides just be yourself. Continue down the path that you're going down and let life unfold the way it's meant to. You spend less time watching what everyone else is doing and spend more time just on yourself. I spend a lot, a lot, a lot of time comparing myself and my journey to other people's. See people achieving their university goals, them buying houses, them getting everything they wanted, like houses, girlfriends, everything like that. And I'm just making silly internet videos and playing League of Legends at home and I really got down on myself. I chose a slower path. I'm a very reserved person. Uh, for those who actually know me personally, I'm way quieter than I put online. And, and I felt back then, and I guess still now, that it is a massive drawback in my personality. I found it super hard to connect to other people. And as I got older, obviously that more reserved nature has caused friendships that I had when I was 18, where you're in constant contact with people every single day, forcefully through school, where that social aspect is just kind of taken from you and you need to put yourself out there a little bit more. Turning 28 is a huge milestone as well. It's 10 years since you've just become of age and you get to look back at all the things you've accomplished since you finished school. And for me, it's kind of difficult. You look back on the last 10 years and you think, oh, wow, all these people have like had crazy parties, super experimental, made and lost friends, created memories and lasting memories of their time at university. For me, that wasn't the case. Look, I did a lot of my university in the last three years through COVID. I floundered around for years at uni, racked up crazy amounts of government debt. And I only really applied myself when I, it was like one of those grindstone moments. I'm like, look, if I'm gonna do this, I gotta do this right. And it was over COVID. So I didn't really make any crazy friends. 18 year old me was lost. 25 year old me was, I gotta finish something. And 20 year old, year old me can look back at the stuff that I've done and I'm kind of happy with what I've accomplished. I've built a great community online and it's something that I always wanted to have. I've created a decent streaming space where I have regular people coming in every single day. My YouTube's still growing. These are the things I really, really care about. I have a strong relationship. I've grown and I'm trying to maintain friendships and make them into a more fruitful lifelong thing because it's difficult. It really, really is. You've have these friendships and these contacts with people and it's hard to maintain them. I've created way more friendships, more than apparently I realize. I, I think I think I have more friends than honestly I realize. I've made a lot online and I've created groups of people that are happy to be around me for long periods of time, which is still absolutely bizarre to me. Being 28 doesn't really change much. It's more of a, I've got to a milestone and a space in my life where I continue working on myself and move on to to the rest of the thousand years I have left on this planet, but it is very cathartic to look back at videos that I've made when I was 18. And I think one of the things that is daunting to me as well is because I was in the mind space when I was 18 of, I want to create these videos because I want to look back at them later and see how far I've come. Or, <laughs> this is going to sound morbid as fuck, if I die, I wanted to have a group of videos where I could always be online and have an internet log of my life and see myself grow up. 10 years later, I look back at this 18 year old Corvi and I can only think of like the next 10 years when I'm 38 and watching this video now. I don't care where I am when I'm 38. I really don't. I really just hope that I'm still doing what I love. I'm still growing as a person and I can look at the mistakes I've made see them as mistakes and be happy to grow from them. Because honestly, that is the only thing that really matters in life. Just be your own person, tread your own path, take your time, be happy with you do with what you're doing, but always, always look forward to doing something else. Build towards something. It, 
might have not have already happened, but if it's tomorrow, that's okay. I created this Word doc when I was 25 when I decided to do uni. And one of the quotes out of that Word doc is something that I think I can pass on as almost wisdom and my own quote from now on, which I'm going to do. So this is my quote and you can use it. It all doesn't matter what comes before it. The day you decide to change and be a new person, everything that came before is the prologue. And I believe that wholeheartedly. Life is in a race. I'm going to be here for a long time yet. I'm very excited to where I'm going to be in the next five years. I really can't wait to do another one of these videos in a couple and look back and not see how far I've come, but see how much I've grown as a person. I'm older and more tired, but besides that, I've still got this burning passion in my stomach, the same that I can see there. Honestly, it's kind of bizarre that I haven't changed that much, but I'm really excited for the next couple years. Really, really, really am. Hopefully you guys are too. Because I can tell you now, the best years of me are yet to come.